basketball with the president, dunking on his delegates. Then I compliment him on his political etiquette. Toss a couple million the air just for the heck of it. But keep the vibes, morning skins, and Ben's complete. There are businesses finding success in this tough economy. Muscle Maker Grill is one of them. This restaurant chain is growing stronger by mixing bodybuilding and healthy eating. Joining us is Rod Silver, Rod Silva, founder of Muscle Maker Grill. Rod, welcome to the show. Thank you, Chris. How you doing? Uh, very good. What was the idea and the thought process behind? Wait a minute. Now I'm seeing McDonald's and Burger King, Wendy's. I can make a healthy food fast food restaurant and make it work. Well, when I first started, I couldn't find healthy food that, that tasted good. So I started creating some recipes that made great food that taste great and they're healthy for it. And, and what made you think, okay, now I'm going to take this instead of making it for myself and start making it for the masses? Well, all my customers, I began to prepare food and we started getting a lot of customers and they want to, you know, expand and make their own restaurants and continue on. So that's how we started franchising. You were 23 years old? 23 years old when I started. And how quickly did you think that franchising was the way to go? And why did you decide to franchise rather than just have company-owned stores? Well, I was just really passionate about the food and creating it. And then uh, my customers just wanted to expand Muscle Maker Nation. And in the same time, I met a fellow named Arthur Gunther, who was a former president of Pizza Hut. And me and him put together a plan. It just exploded. I'm real excited about it. It was just a blessing. What are the barriers of entry for somebody, myself, never had a franchise before, I want to get into it, I like your concept, H how do I get started? Well, the first thing is you can contest us online or through, yeah, actually through our website, musclegrill.com, but we have a, a very affordable course of entry mm -hmm. and we have some very experienced uh, trainers that will train in all aspects, business, operations, cooking, selling, the knowledge. We talk a lot about food inflation here. Uh, and I would imagine processed food, a lot of fast food, uh, they've got to deal with that. But I think you would probably have to deal with that even more so now because your food is healthy. It's probably more expensive to begin with. And when, when inflation really hits, that's going to really squeeze your market uh, margins. Has it already? Well, we haven't felt it yet because we are very tight on, we negotiate our pricing. We're, as we expand, we have more buying power. So right now we try to make great food, affordable food, and convenient food. And so far we've had great margins. Are you a little bit more expensive than the uh, typical fast food restaurant? I, I find it's right there average. You know, average meal is between $7.99 and $9.99, typical stores. And, and what are people, uh, what have been the response from customers? I mean, I think people want to eat more healthy, but yet to, to want to do it and to do it, these are two different things. Right. And what they love about Muscle Man Grill is we make your, your food you love to eat first, right? We make your Italian dishes, your Tex-Mex, all the, your Mexican, your, your American continental Cajun, the foods you normally like to eat, the flavor profile, and we make them in a healthy fashion, like whether we make them less fat or less carbohydrates or use brown rice instead of white rice, whole wheat pasta. So we still give you that flavor you like, but we make it a lot healthier than other guys. We put up a map of where you guys are located. We got New Jersey, New York, Florida. Are you worried about growing too quickly? We, we certainly have seen it, even with some giants like Starbucks grew really quickly. You had Krispy Kreme. We all know about that story. They just yeah. grew too quickly and they lost control of what they were trying to provide to the customer. Well, the key is to get good people. That's the focus. As you get good people, you can grow. And we do a really good job of focusing on really good, passionate people who want to grow Muscle Maker Nation. That's key. It's all about the people, the customers and the owners. What's your number one product? My number one product? Favorite. My favorite product yeah. is the wraps. I eat the Yeehaw wrap. The Yeehaw wrap? What's in there? Yeah, it's a grilled chicken, western potatoes, turkey bacon, our secret sauce that I created 15 years ago that got zero carbohydrates, baked in a jalapeno wrap. All right. Wrap. The Yeehaw wrap. I'm going to have to check it out. Muscle yes. Maker Grill. Rod Silva. Nice to see you. Thanks Thank for stopping you too. by. Thank you. All right, Lauren. All right. That tastes great. Looks good, too. Okay, guys. Thanks so much. Let's take a look.